The kidnapping was all the easier because the seizing of foreigners here is a new type of crime and also because, as a foreigner and the honorary West German consul, Mr. Niedermeyer was convinced he was safe. He was seized at his home last night when two men knocked at the door and asked him to come and inspect damage which they claimed to have done to his car. One of his daughters in the house saw her father in brief conversation, then he was bundled into a dark green Morris car and driven away. The Grundig factory is already one of the largest employers in Northern Ireland, and earlier this month, Mr. Niedermeyer announced the biggest single industrial expansion in the province for many years, the opening of a new factory in the Roman Catholic town of Nuri with some 1,300 jobs. He fought the project through against the wishes of his bosses in West Germany, who thought the situation here too unsafe for development. Mr. Niedermeyer himself was the victim of a hijack attempt at gunpoint here not so long ago, but was allowed to go free when he identified himself as the West German consul.